What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Crystal, a.k.a. Serenity1225, here from the beautiful islands of the Bahamas, and I'm back with yet another Diamond Holistics and Complete Yoni Care product review. So today, I have finally made my way to the Yoni Steam Seat and the Yoni Herbs, the Vaginal Steam Herbs. So, um, did I put the right one? Yeah, okay, I got the right one. Um... I used it one time however I need to use it multiple times because this Yoni steam seat and these vaginal steam herbs is giving okay it's the gift that keeps on giving I've never Yoni steam before so this was a totally new process for me and um, you know I'm saying the kid is gonna get into it so let me just get into a little bit of information about Diamond Holistics and Complete Yoni Care. Uh, the business is located in Nassau, Bahamas. At Diamond Holistics and Complete Yoni Care, we value our clients more than money. There's a money back guarantee. We've got your back. At Diamond, we provide 14 days money back guarantee with 100% customer satisfaction. You can find them on Facebook diamond holistics and complete yoni care you can find them on instagram diamond underscore holistics underscore yoni underscore care the, she's on whatsapp one two four two eight one five three zero five five you can email her at diamond holistics at outlook.com uh, she has affordable shipping fees and she does ship internationally there's also a website. So I'm going to have all of that information listed down below. Um, in my unboxing video, I, uh, she gave me th the menstrual pain relief tea bags, the menstrual miracle drops, uh, exfoliating gloves, PMS soap bar, ice soap bar, turmeric and charcoal soap bar, turmeric facial detox, turmeric facial toner, feminine wipes 100% organic, Yoni Detox Pearls, Yoni Pops uh, 25 count or boric acid suppositories, vaginal tightening capsules, vaginal tightening gel, vaginal steam herbs, vaginal steam seat, and then she later gave me a detox capsules, uh, which is a colon cleanser, okay? So today I'm gonna be reviewing two items from Diamond Holistics and Complete Yoni Care. And that is going to be the Yoni Steam Seat. So this big thing right here, okay. Uh, I hope that you guys can see it because I'll be playing around with my camera, okay. Give you guys a little look a loop, okay. So I'm gonna be reviewing this, the Yoni Steam Seat. This is for $35 on the Diamond Holistics and Complete Yoni Care website and then you can also purchase the Diamond Vaginal Steam Herbs. And the herbs uh, is $15 for a pack like that, okay? So I went and I did a little bit of research about Yoni steaming because I've never done it before. And um, I've seen videos, but I really wasn't 100% uh, knowledgeable, knowledgeable about what yoni steaming is okay so yoni steaming is an age-old practice uh they don't know uh the origins of it but they do believe that it began during ancient times so that's a very wide spectrum of ancient times um uh so basically i want to say this too there is no empirical evidence there's no scientific evidence that uh purports that yoni steaming can cure anything um help with anything that that uh they say that yoni steaming can do so you know i guess from a doctor's point of view there has been no scientific research there's been no scientific evidence to implicitly imply that what yoni steaming quote unquote does 
has been proven, right? Okay, you know, these scientific people always got something to say. Like, stay in your lane, science people. This is something that you had the Mayans, the Mayans used to steam, African steam. I mean, it seems to have been something that has been done culturally all around the world since the dawn of time. But because these ninjas, these scientific ninjas, they can't, they can't prove it for whatever reason. They want to try and dispel it. But, you know, stay in your lane, scientific people. We don't care about y'all. Okay, that was my little rant. Okay, so essentially yanni steaming uh it's been it's been purported that you know when you yanni steam you can have benefits like it can help you relax it can help you with menstrual cramps relieves stress relieves depression it can help with infections sort of like utis and stuff like that which i have all the time if you're new here Hi, my name is Crystal, and I have endometriosis, and my endometriosis literally has invaded my bladder, so I constantly have urinary tract infections, right? Uh, yoni steaming can uh, help with hormone imbalances. It can help with headaches. Uh, it can help with fatigue, digestive is issues. It can help with generalized pain. Um, it's supposed to detox the womb, improve fertility, increase energy. Um, it can help regulate monthly bleeding. It can help ease menopause symptoms, treat hemorrhoids, promote healing after childbirth. Uh, and the research that I was getting myself up to, you can yoni steam three times a week. Okay. So this this practice purports that it can help you with a plethora of ailments right but let me just interject here and say listen i'm not a doctor i'm not a nurse i'm not a gynecologist i'm not trying to tell you that you should forego whatever treatment your doctor might have you on for whatever gynecological issue that you're battling and and say yoni steaming is going to cure cure me so that is not what this video is about. Uh, this video is about me showing you guys how to use the Yanni steam seat, the Yanni steam seat and the Yanni uh, and the vaginal steam herbs. And then I'm also reviewing them because I use them. Okay. So I was blown away. I was not. Oh, I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready. <laughs> so I used it, all right, a few days ago. And um, can I tell you that when I used it, I was extremely stressed out. Like the whole world was against me a few days ago when I used this Yanni steam seat, okay? Um, I had to watch several videos on YouTube as to how to do it. You know what I mean? I didn't know. You know what I'm saying? I don't know how to do it. Like, I don't know what to tell you. So what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to use like, I think like three to four cups of water, heat it up on the stove. Then you will put in a certain portion of the vaginal steam herbs. So let me just open it and show you guys. I'm gonna get into um, the information on the back of this packaging. So this is how the steam herbs come. And this is how the herbs had looked it. So they're basically, you know, dried herbs. Look at like that. Make sure you guys can see, cause I I can I be not seeing. Okay. So you will boil the water on your stove, and then you will include the herbs, however much you want, or however much is recommended based on the packaging. You you bring that to a boil. And then you let it steep. Now, the information that I found on YouTube, it varies on how long you should let it steep. Some people say five minutes. Some people say 10 minutes, okay? So I let mine steep for 10 minutes, right? And then um, you can cover it up with a, um, a, a, a lid, a pot cover. 
and um, let it steep because you really want to get um, all of the oils and whatnot from the herbs, okay? So um, let me put this back here. I got one because I got two. So I'm going to read it. I got to take my glasses off and read it. So um, the vaginal steam herbs. Vaginal steam herbs are a beautiful way to bring warm steam and heat to the pelvis, the pelvis and to the womb by increasing circulation and energy flow. Why women need to steam. One, reducing menstrual symptoms, bloating, cramps, exhaustion, and heavy bleeding, decreases heavy menstrual flow, regulation of irregular or absent menstrual cycles, quick healing and to the productive system, erase discomfort of the yawning, uh, promotes healing after childbirth and C-section recovery, assists with the healing of hemorrhoids, helps to restore bacterial and pH balance to aid in prevention of infections, uh, bacterial vaginosis and odors, relief, relief for symptoms of menopause, helps tighten the yoni, detoxification of the yoni, body and mind. So the directions are as follows. In a medium pot, pour eight to 10 cups of water. Again, you can, you know, at your own discretion, because everywhere I was looking, it was like two cups, one cups. Now this is saying eight to 10. Place 30 grams of yoni herbs into water and bring to a soft boil for five minutes. Turn off heat and place lid or pot and steep for five additional minutes. Pour half of water into the bowl you have placed in the toilet. Wave your hand above it to assure it's not too hot. Um, remove panties and sit with a blanket or a sheet around your waist down to the floor, making sure no steam escapes. When the steam dies down, dump the water into the toilet and repeat the process again starting at four it has it has cooled reheat if it has cooled reheated and be sure to test again before sitting so you can you can definitely steam multiple times okay i love that this packaging had a lot of information but i still went and i found my own information because that's what i do okay i do that i do that okay okay i want to make sure everybody know that the kid is out here learning, researching. I'm not just here telling you people, this is good and that is good. No, ma'am, no, sir. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to learn too. God damn. So that's the herbs. So this is the, you know, there's some uh, sprinklings from the herbs here. So this is how the Yanni seat looks. And this actually uh, pops down, like this extends, right? So it comes with this little tube thingamajiggy. And this is actually to, as you can see, there's like air. And probably there's, oh, I'm sorry, bro. Listen, I could barely tell when you people can see. So um, there's water left inside of it. I should have cleaned it properly, my bad. <laughs> but this is what you do, okay? So this is your vaginal yoni steam seat, okay? And what you do, I'm hoping that you people can see, huh? What you do is you basically press down and you will pop, pop the seat down a little bit more. So now you have a bigger extension. It's, it's wider, okay? And that's how that looks like that. Like, don't mind all the little whatever. You know, I, I had some the scrapings from the, the herbs that I took out and showed you guys. And then... This thing, this thing apparently still had um, some water in it from the last time that I used it. So it's not dirty, okay? It's not dirty. I don't want you to be thinking that it's dirty. Okay, so with this thing, my research yielded that I think that you push it through here. Can you see? You, you push it through here. I want to make sure that you people can see me. Okay, you push it through here, and then you kind of press it down in between those things, and then you have it sitting like that, okay? So this part will be upright like this, 
And then when you use this part, I, I would recommend you using this like um, when the steam is almost gone. So it's basically giving you like a burst of air. So it will help a little bit more of the steam to go up. But do not use this when you first sit on the Yanni steam seat because the the contents, the, the water and the herbs, it's gonna be hot. Now, do not sit on the Yanni steam seat um, if it's too hot, which is why you have to pour it in here. Let me let you guys see. I have to clean this better because I didn't, I, honestly, I just wrapped it up. But what you do is you have to take this part off. I hope this part can come out. Anyway, I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna struggle with it on camera. But you have to detach it, and then I guess you have to pour water down this to clean it as well, because what you guys are seeing is basically uh, uh, liquid residue from the last time I steamed. And this is how we will put this down in here. Keep it in place with these things here. Let me see if you guys can see. Okay. So it should be like this. This part should be, this part should be sitting up. And then when you use this part, you see, you got like a little air, you got a little bit. So it'll give you like a little mist. It'll give you like a little mist of um, the contents of the actual uh, oil, um, the water and so forth. But I use that at the end. You, I would not, do not use this part of it at the beginning of you sitting on the Yanni seat because you will get burned. Also too, make sure, let this, after you take this off the stove, you let it seep for five minutes with the lid on, the, the water and the herbs, then you will put this on your toilet seat, right? This will be the back part of it and this will be the front part. You'll put this in there, you put this in there and it will clamp in place and you pour the the boiled uh, water and yoni uh, vaginal herbs you pour it in here um, I wouldn't allow it to get like all the way up here okay just somewhere around here and then you let it sit for a few minutes so it can cool down but not too much don't allow it to cool all the way down so before you sit on it you can wave your hand over it to see how hot the steam is so again do not sit on this yoni steam seat with the yoni um, herbs and water if it is piping hot because it will burn your vagina okay so there needs to be caution um, and when you sit on it when you wave your hand over it and it's um okay you feel like it's okay then um then you can sit on it with a towel wrapped around you or a blanket i think a blanket would be a better option because I used um, a towel and I had to end up using a second towel because what you're trying to do is you're trying to trap the steam. Uh, so the only place the steam is going to go is up in the vagina, in the yoni. So get you a blanket and wrap it around you and you sit on this for like 20 minutes, okay? And it's going to do what it has to do. Now, I, as you can see, there are contents left over from my little session uh, i don't know what they call this thing but anyway i didn't realize that this had liquid inside of it so i'm gonna have to figure out how to take that apart and clean that properly so this is just um residue remnants of the actual water and uh yoni herbs that i used a few days ago and so it was stuck in this thing so as you can see as you can see, I did use it, okay? Who you talking to? I know you ain't talking to me, okay? So, I felt, I really did, I really did feel relaxed, okay? Let me move this out the way, because that's not pretty crystal. Let me just give you gold. That. Back to that. Okay? So, I did, I did feel relaxed. Um, I was kiki in with one of my girlfriends on the phone, so it was like the time went by really quickly, and then I went out, and um, honestly, I did not have any abdominal pain when I was out. I don't, I don't know how to explain that. 
I only used it one time. I'm not trying to assert that it cured me or anything like that. I could only tell you that after I steamed for 20 minutes of me sitting on the yoni seat, um, I didn't really feel uh, the pangs of my uh, daily abdominal pain. And I, I suffer from severe abdominal pain because of my endometriosis, okay? So um, I don't know how long that would last. Again, I'm not here to treat anybody. I'm not going to tell you that it took my pain away forever, ever, forever, ever. I will say that after I did the steam, I went out and I had a good time. And I wasn't really feeling the typical abdominal pain that I usually have. So I'm intrigued by this uh, practice. I'm going to be using it more because it's going to be like research for me. You know what I'm saying? Because if this can help me on a daily with my severe abdominal pain, then this is going to be something that I will be implementing in my daily life. Okay, so the research that I, I found, they said to... Um, they said to steam three times a week if you have severe chronic pain, okay? So, I'm, I've never, like I said, I've never, I've never Yanni steamed before. All I knew about was Yanni oils and Yanni soaps and stuff like that. I knew about the Yanni seats and so forth, but I've never personally done it. So when I when Diamond, the lady that owns Diamond Holistics and Complete Yoni Care, she included this in the items that she gave me to test and review. I was intimidated by it because I didn't know what the hell it wanted. And then I watched at least, um, I would say I watched a minimum of about 20 videos on YouTube on how to prepare your herbs and how to Yoni steam. So the first time I used it, I was thoroughly impressed with it. <laughs> um, it's supposed to help you tighten your yoni to goils. I don't know, goils. We got to figure this out. So my thing is this. If I'm using this three, time, three times a week, baby, baby, big baby, that means my poodle time. That means my coochie. That means my puss. Wow. It's going to be tighter than a version a second version oh my god i'm here for the yawny steam shenanigans okay <laughs> so listen let's get back to it crystal because i could be long winded you know what i'm saying i like to give you people just a little bit of information or whatever so you can you know what i'm saying just be learned learned as the lawyers say my learned friend so the seat was $35 and the vaginal steam herbs was $15. So I think that this is worth a try. You know, nothing beats a failure but a try. That's what I always say on my channel. Nothing beats a failure but a try. And you can get this from Diamond Holistics and Complete Yoni Care. She's on Facebook, Diamond Holistics and Complete Yoni Care. Uh, Instagram, Diamond underscore Holistics underscore Yoni underscore Care. What's up? 1242-815-3055. You can email her at diamondholistics at outlook.com. She ships internationally and she does have a website. All that information is going to be listed down below. So please do not skip the, the description box. But as for Yanni steaming, me being a novice, and that was my first time, I will say that so far the kid is impressed. I'm intrigued. I... I have to do it a little bit more to really see if it's consistent and if it will help me with my abdominal pain moving forward. But the first time that I used it, I was impressed. Like, I'm not going to sell you. Listen, Goyles, I'm not going to sell you gals no dream, okay? This thing made me feel good, honey. I went out and I was shaking my ass. <laughs> I, when I got home at the end of the night, I did not have any abdominal pain. I don't know. I don't know if this is some sort of, you know what I'm saying, this is some sort of mojo or whatever. I don't know what they got going on here. I don't know what they're doing. I don't know what these herbs are doing, but I like it. And I'm going to do it again and again and again. Oh, my. 
This will be the last of my time. I'll see you guys in my next video. Here we go. Peace.